gamers, welcome back. It's Elden Ring. If you're watching on YouTube, here's my plea, okay? I I was thinking about it the other day. We're, we're going to start up, uh, you know what? Will NL beat this boss before pivoting at 10 a.m. PT? Before pivoting at 10. Yes? No. We're going to do a long bet to, to minimize the... Uh, the overhead here, okay? <clears throat> what I was going to say, though, is, like, I was thinking about, like, when I would record Souls games on YouTube, don't get me wrong, I had an awesome time, but when you encountered a hard boss, it made for some very... Whoa! Sorry, first run of the day. It made for some very frustrating recording sessions sometimes, because I would die to, like, you know... Prince whatever his name is in Dark Souls 3 17 times in a row and then I would just restart the video because I didn't want to like you know if we got 45 minutes of Dark Souls 3 coming up a day I didn't want it to exclusively be dying on the boss that's why I like the Twitch experience honestly it's just more authentic you know because we're we're out here, like, if you're watching the VODs, I encourage you if possible, I know not everybody's in that situation where, like, you know, they're at work. They can just, like, put me on the second monitor or whatever, but it's a much more representative look at what a, a Souls playthrough is actually like. You're not just getting the greatest hits, you're getting the whole concert. You're getting the struggle. You're not just seeing... I mean, I, I will say there was... In the annals of, like, my Souls playthrough over the course of my my many lives, there's some moments that are, ooh, they stand out to me. And those were, like, you know, captured on video. I'm forever grateful for that. I think we beat Vicar Amelia, like, the second time we fought her in Bloodborne, which was kind of sick. Every time. I'll get hit by that every time. I'm gonna heal if you don't mind. I'm gonna I'm gonna die if you don't mind. He's just attacking, man. He's just attacking. <clears throat> Blood Borny. Great also a great moment in Souls history when Larissa from 90 Day Fiance said, um, her do you play video games? And then the guy was like, Yeah. And then she said, My favorite game is Blood Borny. And then she said, Do you know it? And the gamer guy went, No, I've never heard of it, which is baffling. And then she said, it's really good. You have to, like, build your character. And I was like, you know what? Probably not the first thing that I would have said when talking about Bloodborne. But where's the lie? No lies detected. You do have to build your character. Whoa! <laughs> true, true. That's pretty true. You know my problem here. I'm not squaring up. Nice try. Nice try. Much like real life. It's just, it's a great moment. Great moment in Souls history. Larissa. And by the way, if you've never seen 90 Day Fiance, Larissa probably wouldn't be um, the first person you think of when you think of somebody who, uh, you know, Bloodborne is uh, their target audience, you know? They're not a 28-year-old web developer from Brooklyn, New York. They're just like a lady. It's just like, you know, just just living her life, getting synthetic butt implants. And you know what? Who am I to judge, honestly? I mean, that's why I'm watching the show to begin with, but Hey, hey, hey. That's never going to hit. I need to come on, get back to the center of the map. What, are you allergic to killing me? <laughs> Clearly not. Hmm, Kobe. Insane. Insane. Never should have done that. Never should have gone in for three. But you know what? We're getting to phase two. You love to see that. I'm realizing I'm not squaring up enough. That's terrible. That's terrible news. That's even worse. Okay, fair enough. <clears throat> are you allergic to killing me? Became a millionaire of doubting yesterday. Now I'm ready to believe. 
Okay, real talk. Don't get synthetic butts. It'll hurt your spine. Dixie Go, you've been around here for a long time. I follow you on Twitter. Probably, I'm assuming, for, for a trivia win a long time ago. Most of your tweets are in Spanish. So I don't really know what they say. But come on. You, you've been around long enough. What percentage of chat here do you think is in the market for a synthetic butt implant, okay? Let's be realistic. That's like me giving someone in chat, like, advice that's like, hey, if you're an astronaut, like, go to the bathroom before you get it on the launch pad, right? Like, you might not be wrong, but at the same time, the odds of anybody in chat actually having the ability to put that advice to the test seems a little surprising to me. Do you ever stop attacking, just for the record? Astronaut. So true. I get it. Asa. <clears throat> Asa. Nice try. Piece of shit. He's a little aggro. He's a little aggro. I mean, if if you had to ask me, thank you for the appraisal, by the way, that's huge. I bet that's first off dog from when the, the turtle exists. Nice try. Nice try. Then you go over one of these and we punish. If you had to ask me how many people are astronauts, like that actually either have been into space or their career path is that like on the next mission or like on a mission in the next five years, they're going to space. If you were like, how many people on Earth fit that description? My hunch is that the answer is less than a hundred people, but probably more than... He's actually dodged it for once. And then immediately I was like so stunned with myself. Hey Dixie Ego, <laughs> thank you. I didn't do that just to bait you into give a gift subs, okay? It's not the case. I was just making a laugh. I was just having a giggle. Nice try, you piece of shit. I would say more than 80, less than 100. Somewhere between 80 and 100. You stall me, you piece! Three hundred and thirty-nine people from America alone have been to outer space. Yet my second question, though, is how many of those went up on the Jeff Bezos glorified airplane, and how many of those did the Apollo thirteen experience? Okay, come on in. It's our best fight ever. Fair enough. At least. <laughs> No, no. I'm sipping, I'm sipping, I'm staying in. I'm not fucking leaving. I'm not fucking leaving. I'm leaving. You we're so close though. We're in there. Look at that. That's like 28% HP remaining. Did sleeping help? I think so, honestly. I mean, it's, you know, I mean, every Souls game, I make this same um, statement. But it's like Rock Band, right? Like, some days you could study the note chart, you could practice Miss Murder by AFI until the cows come home. Can't get those gold stars. Show up the next day, first run of the day, you're like, I got that hard part in the solo I could never fit. All of a sudden, you're like, you know, the power of sleep, it's amazing. Okay, I didn't expect that. That's fine. I'll sip on that. I'll sip to that. Cheers, brother. Any sleep enjoyers in the chat? Also, if you don't enjoy sh sleep, just shut up, okay? I don't want to hear it. Not me, Sag. Come on, dude. We're having a moment here. Everybody's trying to, like, enjoy themselves. Relax. It's not about you. Good smacks. Good smacks. Nice try. You fucking suck. I'm greedy. But you know what? Greed is good in this situation because it means that I got confidence. A confidence that did not exist for me yesterday now flows through my veins. Nice try. You fucking suck. You suck. 
Yo, stink, look at that. Take your hammer out, you piece. It just gives us a larger punish window anyway. Ooh. Embarrassing. Okay, that one. Not embarrassing. That one's pretty good. So, excuse me, I'm gonna sip. I pressed the sip button, but it was too slow. <laughs> That's fine. Just get out of there. Okay, now we can fight again. Go back on our terms. One of those. Whoa, what a day! That's like... You win one-handed. That's not fair. I'm bad again. I'm Asa. Deserved. I lived. I lived. I lived. I died. I live again. Okay, we're still in there. One flask. No! No! Okay. Square up. That's what you're missing. Not today. Two of those. Two quick ones. Two sword ones. I'm still chilling. You coming up? You coming up and over? Huge. That's a three-piece minimum. It's also a three-piece maximum. Learn. Even if you don't win, we're gonna learn. Bad roll. Honestly, just a bad roll. It's because I started thinking about Alanis. I started thinking about, you live, you learn. You know what I'm talking about? No, I didn't. Look, I got a lot of minus twos yesterday for calling this guy Ant Stamina. And I, I didn't know that until I checked the, the after thread. Because, I, I mean, during the boss fights, I really can't glance at all. I'm surprised at how few plus twos I get, though, whenever I talk about Alanis Morissette when she does the weird voice. You know, when she goes like, um, If only I could meet the maker. You know what I mean? You may not, but if you've ever heard Jagged Little Pill, you know the weird voice. Best recent Alanis Morissette song? Um, this returns N-A-N. There is no uh, entry in the database that matches the data type that you've requested. But that's okay. Hey, what's the best recent Rolling Stones song? Probably came out in like 1972. They're still selling out Madison Square Garden. Ooh. I think it's a good sign that we're on like banter mode for phase one. It's not to say, you know, that's gonna last forever. Start Me Up came out in 1981. As much as I want to prove my point, I would agree that, like, if you like the Rolling Stones, Start Me Up is a good song. Now, I'm not a huge Rolling Stones fan outside of, you know, Beast of Burden, you know, All of Exile on Main Street, the occasional classic rock jam. Nice try. That's a, that's a two-piece, then bail. Take take your dividends, get out. Woo! Woo! You got a little more in there? I don't think so. I shouldn't have done that. That's terrible news. That's terrible news. I'm alive. Sip me. Sip me! Oh, the die to a dagger. The indignity. It's all right. Every time we get a little closer. Why are you not squaring up? Honestly, I just forgot. I just, I square up. I forgot. Hey, NL, there's a summon on this fight that will give you the last edge you need to win. It's up to you. Thanks, I was unaware. Um, appreciate it. That's why I made the title of the stream... Um, Backseaters welcome because it is it's my first souls game so I figured like it's time to dispense with the pride and instead just like you know let the souls veterans tell me all the techniques that you use to win souls games like summon uh, about 15 jellyfish out of your uh, solar plexus every 10 seconds if possible and you know summon uh, great sorcier Roger I'll consider it, okay? I'll, I'll take it under advisement. Never should have done that. 
But here I am. Oh, what are you doing? More, more. It's been a good fight so far. It's been a good dance. It's been a good back and forth. You're, you're honestly a little bit of a coward. Who uses backstep in PvP? You know who uses backstep in PvP? S-Talk users? You want to be an S-Talk user? I, I felt that one go wrong. It was an early roll. That's fine. We'll even call... I, I would describe it as a panic roll. I would describe that as the opposite. I was like, I'm never going to panic roll again, so I just didn't roll at all. Take a sip. It's all right. He's, he's, some combos are, you know, they're not created equal. Some of them are easier to dodge than others. Huge. A little back roll won't hurt you. That time I also did not release the button in time. Are you coming in on me? I would welcome it. I thought, honestly, God is my witness. I thought I had the stam to get out of that. <clears throat> Please get a single wafer thin piece of armor for your chest. I will never buy armor in this game. That's the thing. I'll, if I find armor, if I, if I walk through a poisonous swamp and I pick up a tattered potato sack that says, like, you know, Swampkins bracers, I will wear them. I deserve to get hit there, just to be honest. I will wear them in a heartbeat. But I will never go to um, a shop and be like, yeah, sell me that shirt for 2,000 souls. I mean, if you got the chance to invest in yourself and you invest in clothes, like, I'm, all I'm going to say is you better have a lot of disposable runes because I'm not in that position right now. I would rather invest in myself and reap the rewards of that permanently rather than get some material trinkets and baubles. Plus at. I'll take that. You know what the spirit of that message was. You can tell. That was a horrible roll. That's fine. I'm probably not one shot. This is where we want to be. And don't forget about squaring up. It just keeps you in the game. That's the thing. You square up, then you stay... Oh my god, are you seeing that side boob? Good stuff, man. Two more. Two quick ones. I'm out. Go ahead. Whoa! Okay, you can't always square up. That's one thing you gotta learn. <laughs> I know I said we gotta square up. There's like one combo that is really hard to bail out of the square up in time to escape. Nice try. Ooh. That's extreme greed. Let's acknowledge the greediness. That was uh, what's known as a panic roll, and I deserved to be killed there. I was I was off the. I was off the beat. I was dancing and I was clapping on the ones and threes instead of the two and fours. <clears throat> Do you think the Canucks will make the playoffs NL? No, absolutely not. A zero percent chance. I mean, it's not literally a zero percent chance. It's probably like a... If I had to guess, I would say like a six percent chance. But I would also say, like, as a Canucks fan, I mean, if we make the playoffs, I would be stoked. Because, you, you know, you buy yourself a ticket to the dance, at least. You got a ticket in the, in the lottery sweepstakes. I mean, not literally the draft lottery, unfortunately, but, you know. Anything can happen. Eight seeds win the Stanley Cup on occasion. Like, that one time that it happened. Um, but I, I would really rather the Canucks didn't make the playoffs this year. Even if, you know, they're not going to be in a great position to win the draft lottery, just to, you know, not even just have a chance to get the first overall, but just to get a better draft position in general will serve the team better than, like, a first or second round exit. Which is the best you could realistically hope for with this core right now, I think. Who's worse historically, the Canucks or the Blue Jackets? It depends on your perspective. I mean, the Canucks have more playoff success than the Blue Jackets. The Blue Jackets have what, like, two playoff series victories in their entire NHL career? 
Um, but the Canucks have been in the league like 2.5 times longer and have yet to, to win a Stanley Cup. So they, you know, they both have a, a certain degree of cursedness. But like, at least for now, at least the Canucks have had some regular season and playoff success, whereas I feel like Columbus hasn't exactly. But they're still, you know, a young franchise. Okay, now shit gets a little real. Right, run. That's when you run. This is the part where we run, Joss Whedon. Sip. Now we're back in it. Acceptable. I don't mind. That gives you breathing room. Then you come in. Two quick ones. Huge. This isn't the direction I normally dodge. I'm saved. Okay. I'm not saved, but I'm not dead. One sip, no hits. All killer, no filler. All filler, no killer. Okay. Less of the sword attack, please. At least we got one. Hammer jump. Deserved. Honestly, the delays are so strong. Nope. 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 Sip right in his fucking face. Oh! Okay. One flask. Hey, you know what? That's more flask than he's got. I lived. Sip me. Zero flasks. You know what? That's as many as he's got. Huge. A little tricky. Stop with the sword attacks! <laughs> he does... He does weird walking stick. He does, uh... Hammer, I got no problem. He starts doing swords, I'm like, I'm out of here. All I'm doing is mashing the circle button as fast as I can. Maybe you should put these foolish ambitions to rest. Honestly, the only people who need to do that are the... Are the instant gratification addicted dopamine slaves in chat? And that doesn't describe everybody in chat, but you know the type. You know, they're the type where they ordered their food like five minutes ago and they're like, God, I just can't wait for my food to get here. You know, like you, you don't want your food to arrive that fast. It's actually a... It's a cursed sign if your meal arrives like five minutes after you order it, unless it's like ramen. In which case you're like, that's, that's pretty sick. That should have been an easy dodge, honestly. The longer a fight is, the more satisfying it is when you inevitably succeed. And you will inevitably succeed. Unless your mental has holes in it. Like an Emmental. Nobody's making an ESPN 30 for 30 about Tim the Tatman. If he wins his second ever game of Fall Guys. It's only because he lost, like, 2,000 in a row that he became one of the greatest underdog stories in esports history. Okay, face me in the center of the map, please. That's an embarrassment for you. That, that should have been your moment. Ooh. <laughs> Fair enough. That hurts. I was in a great spot there, too. I was getting kind of clean with it. Remember to say, oh, cool, when you die? Dude, people are going to laugh, but, like, um, I watched Apollo play, like, five minutes last night, and I honestly think I'm not worried about spoilers in this game at all, because I think it's so long that I will not remember, like, any of the spoilers that I see by the time I actually get there. As long as they're sufficiently far away in the game. Like, I watching Apollo play Elden Ring 62 hours in, or wherever he's at, 
was honestly like watching someone play a different video game. I was like, what is he even doing? Good stuff. We can tell you about Margit too. I mean, honestly, you might take that as a tilt, but it wouldn't even bother me. The more of the... I mean, if they want to go the God of War 2018 route, I mean, it worked. They won a lot of Game of the Years and just make every boss be the same boss. By all means. We've already learned... Ooh! So much by fighting this guy that, like, this would just be... It would be a dream come true if all bosses were this guy. We would face a minimal amount of, uh, of strife. That hurt. That hurt. I'm gonna sip. All things considered, that was kind of sick timing. That was not, though. I'll sip again, if you don't mind. That's a new one. I'm gonna have to dodge and attack the sip. Just kidding. Sip right in your damn face. Just run. Okay. I'm taking my chances. Sip me. Good sip. Good sip. Stay in there. You got to do some damage at some point. That'll be now. Huge. Wait him out. You know this one. That's a three piece, four piece. Let's do three. Stay safe. Stay alert. Stay safe. And then square up. Let him know we're not going down that easy. That hurt. Can I tell you, I, I did an extreme cowardice move there. I thought that if I got up, I would have iframes. But I did not. Square up and then use a follow up. You know what? It just seems weird to use a move called square up and then follow it up with like a heavy attack because my only like safe window to do this is after he's finished a combo. It's not like I'm going to interrupt him and at least as of this point I've never had like a stagger window or anything like that. I'm alive. I'm not sure about that. It seems like, you know, we're basically getting the, the damage of three attacks in like the the space of 2.5 attacks technically is that better absolutely you know what else would be better though uh executing one single roll when at present i'm failing it also does extra posture damage i love having nerds in my chat I don't know what that means. Is this Dungeons and Dragons? Does he have like a cantrip? Is there a, he can only use some of his combos a certain number of times? Okay, I'm out of, I'm almost out of mana now. But I can't deny it served me pretty well. Hey, just back off for a second. I got a sip, man. Ooh, sip me? <laughs> nice try. Yeah, yeah, then come in. Then, oh, I want you to... Yeah, ba keep him at a distance. I can take this. Rolled a little too early, but I'm chilling. <laughs> oh. He's got me. He's got... Fair enough, fair enough. <clears throat> I'm not a thing. Posture was in a game that you played. What game? Cookie Yomi? Politeness Simulator? Oddly, r slash oddly satisfying the game? Look, I'm a simple man. The game gives me one meter to worry about. That was not smart. Or was it? That's the meter I'm going to worry about. Ooh, that... I input buffered myself into oblivion. 
Run away. Perfect opportunity. Thank you. You have a mana flask? Are you willing to bet some gifted subs on this information you're so confident in? He's technically... That's true. I guess I do have the flask. It's just empty. All right. What's your channel? I'll give you some subs. I think we need a casino. You're absolutely right. That's why I ran the casino. Great minds think alike. I'm glad we're on the same page there. Okay, try to give him some... If, if posture damage is a real thing, and I'm not completely convinced that it is, what if we try giving him some punishes to the face instead of punishes to the tail? You know, this isn't Monster Hunter. Hey, Kronos, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. What if we try not hitting the button at all and just getting destroyed? That's another alternative. <laughs> <clears throat> if you jump R2 five times, he will get staggered. Okay, let's give it a try. What a name, man. It's not really a thing. Imagine if it worked, though. If it's six, I'm going to be pissed. Nice try. <laughs> okay, but it does so much less damage than my than my my normal punish, man. Maybe I can make up some of that on this on the Oh, no. I don't know about this one, man. I feel like I got to I'm, I'm defaulting to Copium right now, which is like, maybe there's one little technique that I'm missing. It's possible, I mean, slash definite, that I'm like, not um, the optimal Elden Ring player. But also, the main technique I'm missing to beat this guy is definitely just dodge, like, two extra attacks. And maybe don't get so greedy in a moment like that. I will say, I was a little late on that one, but actually the, the square off heavy attack follow-up actually strikes me as being like, maybe a little bit more efficient. Plus it has an expiration date, which is when we run out of mana. I like that. That's all right. That's not all right. <clears throat> It's called, you need to summon bell, 10 more levels of shirt, and a grasp of the mechanics of the game. Remember yesterday when I was waxing uh, philosophical about how the Souls community is not actually toxic? I mean, I still mean that, but everybody but that guy. That guy, you're going to need to quiet down. You're giving the rest of the community a bad name. Everybody else leaving messages like, why is it always dog? My quarrel is not with you. It's just that person. Face me. I am letting you know, by the way, I don't, I don't mean to leak Chibli's messages. I don't know how many people in here are also uh, Chibli viewers. I can only say this because he's still asleep because he's in New Zealand. You guys are going to make Chibli stop playing the game. My man's like, he's talking about beating bosses off camera. Because he says low key, streaming this game is actually really irritating. And I was like, you know what? I disagree. Like, it's it's all I want to do right now. But I could totally see how you would feel that way. 
this is the moment. A follow up. Good. Right. Dude, that stabbed him right through the underside of his chin. That's got to be one of the worst places to take a sword wound. And a sip. Okay, let's have a real fight. <laughs> That's bad. I deserve that one. <clears throat> he was also kind of drunk by the end of his last stream. Yeah, but those might be, like, connected. You know what I mean? The irritatingness of, of streaming the game, well, you know, 5% of the chat goes, SHOOT! Might be connected to Chip being a little drunk by the end of the stream. No sword. That's fine, that's fine. Get a little breathing room. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now you might wonder, like, and now it seems like you're irritated. I would say that's true at like a 4 out of 10 level. But when I was streaming it on YouTube, it was different. I was irritated, or recording it for YouTube. I was irritated with myself. Having the ability to channel that irritation towards a third party is actually... I don't know if I say healthy, but it feels less bad. Ooh, okay. I'm gonna have to sip here. It's awkward sip timing, but if it's gotta be done, it's gotta be done. This is hammer time. You know he's gonna go early hammer. You saw it coming. One third of the HP down, he's going early hammer. But you would be mistaken if you thought the hammer was the problem. It's the sword that's the problem. I think we want to keep you at a, at a large distance. Bait out your easy attacks. Two tap you. Try again. Do your hammer attack. Okay, do the one where you stab your Okay, that's fine as well. Honestly, that's fine. Huge. Keep you at a distance. Do an initiate. Do an initiation attack. Terrible news. I'm alive. I'm still gonna live. Take a sip. I'm stuck on some swords. I am now on a... I'm stuck on a rampart, like Woody Harrelson in his ammo. Initiate me. Yes, I'll take it. I should have been... Less greedy, sip in his face. <laughs> mm, less greedy, like I said. Sip in his face. Good stuff. That one, I was a, a microsecond late. Sip me, sip me. He's not aggressive enough. You're not the one. You're the one, okay? Sip me. You're going to initiate. Let's, let's go back to our formula from earlier. Initiate me. Initiate me. Initiate me. Do your initiate. This is where we punish. Initiate me. I had to make a move at some point. Rebellion, initiate me. Whoa! I'm going three because I missed the first one. That's dangerous rhetoric. Come in on an initiate. Patience. Hammer me. Huge. I'm getting one. Because I was scared of something like that. Ga close my gap. Close my gap. We'll take it. Back step. That hurts. I'm still alive. Insanely good sip. No sips remain. No! Oh! Good buffer. Back me up. We're hanging. Hammer me. Bit by bit. He's getting a little scared, too. I'll take it. Sword me. Lucky. Okay, initiate on me. 
Don't back me into a corner. Initiate on me. You want to square up? Then let's square up. Oh, no. Stay calm. There's still a chance. This is the best it's ever been. HP looking pretty similar right now. Hammer me. That was... Oh, if I was a little closer, he goes hammer there. 100%. Heart rate monitors pumping. <laughs> this close. This close. Honestly, I think we win that if we have one extra flask. If we didn't lose a flask willy-nilly in the early game, I think we're good. Whoops, I've accidentally gestured instead of traversing the mist. Hold on, is there a message here? Be wary of sorcerer. That's collateral damage. Take one of these. Okay, early game we stay on you. None of your attacks are that scary. Even the light Yagami does almost no damage. Early game you stay aggro. Saved. Saved. Stay on him. Beautiful punish window. I thought they were going to make hard bosses in this game. Isn't that the thing? Like, again, this is my first Souls game, so I don't know this for sure. But I thought one of the things about this game was, like, that the bosses were supposed to be, like, kind of hard. Am I mistaken? This guy's landed, like, one little pip of damage on us. And that's it. Now he's going to summon a hammer because he can't win the old-fashioned way. No chance. Where's your hammer? You know you're going to... Okay, one more combo. Thanks for the free damage. You're welcome. Okay, here comes the hammer. Square up. Do it. Hammer at 50% HP. I like my odds a little better. Then be careful. You know... It's, it's the initiate you gotta dodge there. It's not the hammer, it's the initiate. Because if the initiate hits you, the hammer's taking you out. I, I actually meant to roll and escape there. I was scared. I'm stuck on some swords. Great Sippertunity. Terrible Sippertunity! I didn't know you could run like that! I'm gonna make you pay your pound of flesh, okay? Interesting thing to not ever uh, attack. To never attack him is an interesting way to play this game. Deserved. Deserved. Jump me. Sip in his face. Don't get scared. This is why we got flasks, okay? You got three flasks remain. In time, you will know what it feels like to lose. To believe so desperately that you're right and to fail all the same. We out here? Hammer me. You know that's hammer. We punish with a two tap. Then we bail. Dodge the. Oh, that's fine, dude. At least only get hit by one of those is the start. And then sip. We gotta stay in there. It's aggro. Backstep me. I'm running. Okay, we're hanging. No sip required yet, although it's a little spicy. Oh no, he's in, he's in never stop attacking mode. <laughs> I want to sip. I want to sip. Two tap me. And then you bail, I bail. Okay, stay in there. But only at an initiation distance. 
You have to figure out. You got to choose your initiates. Do we want this one? Yes. That's a big one. We like that one. Then we bail. Then we bail. Got some free damage. Get out there. I like this one. Oh, <laughs> deserved. So deserved. Zero flasks. Okay. Now we're even. Easy mode's over. It's time to play the game for real. That was a good move. I thought about glancing and then countered my glance, but it got me hit. Good slice. Whoo! Woo! Okay. Initiate on me. Not with that one. No. Initiate on me with a move I know. Not that one either. Yes, this one. Save. Okay, we're gonna have to dodge one here. We can't choose. That's where we bail. Now we've got favorable positioning. Give me the initiates. I want them. I want them. Give me something good. Give me something good. Not that. How we dancing here? How we dancing? It's not my favorite either. How we dancing? Like this? I'll, I'll take that dance any day of the week. I will in, avoid this dance any day of the week. We got 15 minutes. I'm actually feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good. We know how we want this to go. It's all, it's a, it's a negotiation. Every boss fight is a negotiation. He offers something, we take it, or we, uh, or we rebuke it. Like, in the early stages of the fight, we take everything. We take that for sure. Late stage of the fight, we take everything that doesn't start with a sword attack. This is beautiful. Oh, you cheeky little son of a gun. It's still beautiful, like 80% of the time he doesn't do the follow-up. Okay, he's actually mad, which means we're winning. Like he's only doing the attacks that are impossible to, uh, to stay up on him. This is not good. <laughs> there we go. Get back in there. You're going to slice his tail off. It's going to give you Quaylog's Fury Sword when you take it to the giant blacksmith. Excuse me. Lost some frames there. People probably thought I was playing the Steam version. I deserve that one. At least it's a new way to die. <laughs> There's no funnier sound. Like, the same way in uh, Super Mario 64. The same way... It's so funny when Mario falls on his back. That's what it's like in Dark Souls when you fall off the edge. And your guy, like, you know it's gonna happen because the camera instantly changes to, like, you fucked up mode. And then the scream. Ah! Can I recommend a new uh, tactic? You absolutely can recommend a new tactic. I'm leaving out the part of whether or not I will read the rest of the message because I'm a little busy right now. But I can't stop you from typing something in chat. Until after you've typed it, at least. Okay. So far, so good. Back me up. Initiate on your own terms. 
Terrible time to square up. But you know what? Maybe we baited him into a false sense of security. Good punish. No hammer yet, please. A little early for the hammer, in my opinion. I don't like dodging near these wooden posts. You're lucky. Okay. Sure. Now, it's, it's a game of whittling. We whittle and run. It's a whittle and run. This is good. Oh, you're supposed to hammer me there. I was probably too far away. Do something. Do so. I like I like keeping you pinned here as long as I can. I deserve to I deserve to get hit. Maybe not this many times, in my opinion. Great opportunity. Whittle and run. We're back. Five sips. You know what? With five sips. I wouldn't be averse to taking one. Just to stay safe. Okay. I meant to say I wouldn't be averse to uh, wasting one. Four sips. Initiate on my terms, please. On my terms. You offer, I refuse. I'm, I'm still refusing. Any refusers? Timing is all jacked up now. I'm alive. Holy cow. Get out of there. And die. <laughs> Golden straight sword, man. <clears throat> Can I suggest laying your foolish ambitions to rest? What What is my foolish ambition? I know that you're quoting the game, but like, clearly you think the joke is funny. So why don't you explain the punchline to me, joke explainer? What's my foolish ambition? I come from a mindset of um, positivity and plentifulness, where whether you believe you can or you can't, you're right. So I don't see any ambition as foolish, unless it was foolish uh, in concept. Okay, that was a foolish ambition to not roll. You know, what do we just... I'm, I'm going Tekken mode on your ass. I'm getting you pinned against the wall, and I'm going to spam low kicks. And then I'm going to die, and then I'm going to sip. Okay, four sips. Rush me. Try again. That one should never be hit by. We gotta call that one what it is, which is an embarrassment. But stay in there. Use it. Quinn, use it. Reign of Fire strats. Matthew McConaughey strats. I'll fight you on the edge. You think I care? This is just Bowser 3, man. Who's scared? Who's, who's running away? You tell me who's scared. I think I know who's scared. Who's doing the backstepping? If you find out who's doing the backstepping, I'll tell you who's scared. Take one of those right to the forearm. Nice try. I still got green. Better. Better. Now run. Okay. Should have punished that one, but we'll take it. Golden straight sword, we, we say no. You hammer me, we say yes. I'll even two-piece you there. That's how that's how confident I was. No chance. Okay. Some chance. Oh come on. Come on, man. You know what? You wanna do it like that? Let's do it like that. Zero flash, you're just gonna hit me with the same combo over and over? I guess one good play deserves another. Okay, 50% zero flash. I'm ready. I'm ready to try. That's when the light Yagami's hurt, when you're on zero flasks. This is hammer, this is punishable. And we whittle, like the Doobie Brothers. We go minute by minute, 
You gotta look at your dance card, okay? When he offers you a dance, you say yes or you say no? We say yes. We say no. Sometimes you don't have a choice when you get backed up against the wall. We say yes. He says no. Okay, do it again. We say yes. Could have taken that one probably, but that's okay. Hammer me? Huge. We say yes again. Very nice dodge. Now, do we say yes or no? We say no. We say yes. <laughs> He's scared. He's scared. We say yes. Get to a superior position. Ooh, that's bad. Didn't get hit by the follow-up, at least. Okay, we say no. We say yes on this one. We take the fight on our terms. <laughs> Heavy yes. Heavy no. Okay. We got one more chance. <clears throat> One more chance. For the casino, at least. Level up, question mark? Yeah, maybe I'll just spend uh, an hour killing hollows talking about hamburger buns for like the 20th time instead of playing like the part of the game that everybody waited six years for. Just so, like, I don't have to be good to beat the boss fight. Just so I could, like, completely nullify the challenge of the game, which is the main reason people play these games to begin with. Farming plus twos, plus twos, thank you. I love to see the plus twos. I will say... We, we run the gamut here. I apologize, sometimes people catch strays. Like when I died in one of the um, one of the attempts yesterday, someone said, you panicked. I thought this was such a, an obvious statement that I replied harshly and said, why did I look like you look when you receive a phone call? That one I was like, funny, yes, necessary, no. <laughs> it felt good in the moment to say, but afterwards, I was like, you didn't have to do it like that. But then today, I'm like, you know what? I think it was the right thing to do. It felt good to hear it. I did also accuse somebody of being an anti-vaxxer for no reason. But that's just because I wanted to get chat on my side against the chatter in the easiest way possible. And that seemed like the... That seemed like the easiest way to accomplish that feat. <laughs> Six flasks, huh? We don't take those. We take those. Summoning makes the fight easier? What is this? Uh... Jeopardy category, obvious statements uh, for 100. Yes, hammer me. Who would have thought? Don't throw a dagger at me. I'm happy, man. Five flasks. Now just imagine you're not on five flasks. Imagine you're on zero flasks. And play accordingly huge zero flasks we're on zero flask meta careful that might become reality soon huge 
Huge. Huge. Incredible dodge. Okay, we gotta pick we gotta pick our engagement. That's not the one. You know what? On five flash. I'm not scared. Five flasks, we take a safe one. Hammer me. You did it. Do it. I'm saved. I'm alive. That's a nasty one to get hit by because that's an easy punish, but this is why we got flasks. We dodge. I want to choose my engagement. That's not my choice. That's not my choice. I'm alive. Sip, sip, sip. That's a punish. Okay. Oh, it's not a punish because he's using light Yagamis. Okay, stay in there. Imagine you're on zero. Hammer me, and we're right back in this. And we're right back out of this. I got a sip. It's got to be done. Huge dodge. Got caught admiring my own dodge. Now we are on zero flasks. Hammer me. Never say we don't keep it exciting. I'd like to choose my engagement. Two light Yagamis. Ideal engagement. I hate my positioning here, but at least we got a hit. We accept it. I thought I died. We take it. I'm crouched. <laughs> no, not my tempo. My tempo? Not my tempo. <clears throat> Hammer me. Thank you. No greed. Give me a good attack. No swords? He's gonna sword, man. That was a good punish, but I got scared. Hammer me. Oh! Square up, motherfucker! <laughs> Pay out the believers. Rest at the bonfire. Only two minutes late, I'll take it. You cower in fear of the night. You you cower in fear. How's that for suspense? Hey, there's Zafin. Thank you for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Thank you. Slash marker Elden Ring. Slash Discord. Hello.